Good morning, Jesse. Uh, just a thought, is this the most comfortable uh, you felt and maybe the most confident you felt since you've been at Edmonton? Uh, yeah, I think uh, playing, playing uh, pretty good right now and try to help the team and uh, it's nice to play with those couple guys, Connor and Nudes, and uh, I think just working hard every day, and, and uh, that's the thing right now. And have to keep moving every day and do those right things all the time. Ryan Rashog, TSN. Jesse, you've scored on a couple of really nice shots this year. Um, you always had a good shot. Is it something that you've worked on in the last little while? Tell us about your shot. Uh, I think not not a big difference like how I work my shots. Uh, I take those shots when I have chance and uh, that's it. Uh, I think I try to shoot a lot and hopefully that's sometimes going. Have you ever made any significant changes in your stick, the length of it, the curve? Have you always used the type of stick you do, or have you changed it at all over the years? No, it's, I had same sticks the last six years. Jim Matheson, Post Media. Uh, Jesse, when you were a, a junior player, you, you always got more assists than you got goals. Is that because you pass more, or, or you just did, you have you played on the line with Line A and uh, Line A was the shooter. Uh, yeah, hard hard to say. Uh, I played with Line a couple tournaments, so then I maybe was more passer. But uh, I think uh, hopefully uh, I think I can do both. Um, and when you play on the line with McDavid. Um, are you? Does he talk to you and says, "Look, just get into the open. I'll get you the puck." Uh, not much. We, I think, we just play hockey and make those plays when there we have those. And uh, I try to uh, help me all the time. Uh, I try to uh, skate well and do those plays what we have, and that's it. Thank you. Ryan Rashog, TSN. You've made some really nice defensive plays where you back check hard and break up plays. Um, I imagine that your coach likes that. Do you hear from him when you make those sorts of plays too? And how important are those plays for you? Uh, yeah, I think I always try to be like uh, uh, able to back check hard like not tired uh, when we have to defense. I try to always change uh, when I'm st I still have energy and so I can uh, skate both ways uh, and yeah. And I'm not sure if you'll share this with us, Jesse, but where are you staying now that you're here in Edmonton? Where are you living and what are you doing when you're not playing hockey? Uh, I have a house here and uh, I just get new puppy, name is Jaffa, and Golden Retail, and we walk with uh, him a lot, and that's that's cool. Is that your first dog? That's yeah, your own? yeah. First dog. Derek Van Dees, Post Media. Hi, Jesse. I uh, just wanted to ask you what it feel like to score the goal to give Connor McDavid his 500 NHL point. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, feels, uh, I don't know. Good, good, good for him. Uh, I scored uh, his 500 points. Uh, that's that's cool. <laughs> it, it sounds like you really haven't thought about it. Did, did, did even did you even know it was his 500 point? Did you even think it, about it when you scored it? Actually, I I, I know it, but uh, that's really good. Uh, for him, like 500 points, and he have one year older than me, so he he doing great. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. Jim Matheson, Post Media. Couple of things, Jesse. What kind of dog is it? 
a golden retilo. Okay. And uh, are you one of those people that can cook for himself, or do you always have to go out? Uh, actually, my co girlfriend cook me all the time, so that's that's good for me. I don't I don't really like cook. I I like to eat. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse.